Welcome back to End Zone. It's the Jim Beam Homegrown Special this evening. We're catching up with some artists that are playing. There is a plethora of artists with the first announcement. So many already made. Uh, and then we've got 18 more acts and DJs to be announced. But with me right here is Ruby Frost. How are you? Hello, I'm good, thank you. Now, um, not since I last caught up with you, you have released your album, Volition. How's it been going? It's been good and it's been such a relief to get it out there. And really? it's like, uh, it's been this line in the sand, you know, I haven't had to work on it anymore or think about it since then, which is oh, really nice. It, it must be like that, I suppose, because you've been leading yeah. up to it being your debut album as well, slogging away. And it's just, yeah, and, and I kept wanting to tweak little things here and there and change things. So it was good just to finally be like, okay, no, that's, this is it, you know? Cut. It's okay. done. Yeah. Um, now tell me, you've obviously you had your album release parties and all that kind of thing, haven't they? Yeah, really fun. It was cool. Yeah. We went to we played shows in Auckland. Uh, hang on, Auckland, Hamilton, Tarana and Wellington. Mm -hmm. And it was just really fun to play the new songs and get yep. out there. And, and the response was good and we just had a blast. And then I've just been over in Aussie playing some shows over there. And Tell me about it Australia. Fun. It was it, great. Yeah, good response? Yeah, good. Re um, Melbourne was probably the best city for us. Mm -hmm. Like Sydney, everyone's a bit cool over there. But um, They're a bit cool in Melbourne too, but maybe a little bit more can take the mickey out of themselves. But what do yeah, you think? I think they like to party a bit harder. Yeah, there, I well, Which is quite good. And, and we um, went and opened for Evermore on their tour, which is quite really? fun. Um, yeah, choice. It was a good, it's been a good few months really. Good times for yeah. you. What is the plan with overseas for you? Are you wanting to, you know, do you think you'll shift over there at any stage? Or? No, it's really yeah. hard to tell. Um, my album's coming out in Aussie next year, early next yeah. year, so I'm trying to get over there as much as I can, but um, who knows, it's all a bit up in the air at the moment. You've just got to go with the flow <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and exactly. see what happens, I don't know. It's my new motto in life. Totally, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> um, so of course you're playing Homegrown, um, have you, did you do, have you done Homegrown before? No, I've never been. Oh, ever? No. No, so I don't know what to expect. Okay, well, um, it's quite mad. Is it? But um, most times, I think, pretty much every time I've gone, the weather has been stunning. Wellington turns it on every year for some reason. So um, it's a great vibe of all sorts of people mingling. And I um, can't wait. I love playing in Wellington. It's so much fun. I was born there, so I think every time I go there, it feels like home. Okay. You know? Yeah, so it's nice. going to be a fun time. So what stage are you on? Well, it's like the hip-hop slash pop stage, which is really funny. Ooh. And so, who else is on that stage with you? It's like me and Zoe, and then all these like gangsters. Ooh. So that's really funny. I can't wait. It's going to be a cool time. Holding your own amongst the boys. Yeah. The backstage after party might be a bit crazy. Could get a little bit ruckus. Yeah. Um, but no, I can't wait. It's going to be really fun. Um, now, you've just released a new single. We've had it as release of the week um, uh, here on Endzone. It's called Young. Can you tell me about the song? Yeah, Young is a song all about um, just trying to move on from past things and, and not have any regrets really. Mm -hmm. I kind of wrote it after this really nasty breakup and I was just thinking, well I'm actually still young, why do I feel so heavy and so weighed down? So it was just kind of a song that I wrote trying to process everything and trying to learn how to move on. And did it help? Again, it totally helped. Oh, yeah. and, I, and I love performing it now because it's just like a good reminder, you know, just yeah. seize the day and not care See about any of that stuff. Really catchy too as well. Oh, Tell me about the video clip. We filmed it actually in Sydney when we were just over there and um, oh, cool. it was so much fun. It was a really spontaneous shoot. We just, um, you know, we had all these random people turning up that were friends with the director over there and um, it kind of just turned into this party and people were like setting things on fire and setting off fireworks and it Sounds was like really fun. Friend. Fireworks as well. Yeah, right. brilliant. Cool. Um, so I loved it. We're going to go check out the video clip for Young right here and we will see you homegrown and yeah. uh, see you next time. Yeah, sure.